Say goodbye to boring keyboards because in this video we'll be showing you the best custom keyboards for iOS 9. Whether it be a fun theme, a useful keyboard that allows you to type using just your thumb, a custom keyboard that allows you to use different fonts to liven up your text conversations or even Instagram posts, or even an interesting keyboard that allows you to type using just your handwriting. These are the best keyboard apps for iOS 9. Let's get started. Before we get started, I wanted to very quickly show you how to enable custom keyboards on your device. Once you download one of the apps recommended in this video, the links are all in the description, what you'll do is you'll go to the settings application, go to general, and then in general you're going to scroll down to keyboard, and then you're going to choose keyboards, and then choose add new keyboard, and then you'll choose the keyboard in the list that matches the one you want to install. Once you have a new keyboard installed, the way that you access that keyboard, say for instance we're in notes, is by clicking the global icon at the bottom which will first change it to the emoji keyboard and then click ABC and that'll change it to the next keyboard in your list. That's how to enable iOS 9 custom keyboards. There might also be additional settings in each app itself and some specific apps may require you to go in and allow full access. So that's again in the keyboard section under the specific keyboard and then enable allow full access. Now, be sure to read the security prompts because there is important information, but some keyboards require you to select that as well. So that's how to install the keyboard apps. Now let's take a look at the top 10 iOS 9 keyboard applications. The first keyboard app that we have is Blink. Now, Blink also comes with different themes that you can use, such as this blue theme, even a Christmas theme. There are a lot of different themes available in the app, but some are available for a premium purchase. Now as you can see, in addition to the regular keyboard, you also have predictive type up at the top, so you can choose different words that you are going to type. Now in addition to this, and one of the best features, is the ability to quickly change the entire keyboard to access using just one thumb. Now the way to do this is just swipe over on the middle line of text. Now I can quickly text using one thumb. Now this is perfect for people who have the iPhone 6S Plus or the iPhone 6 Plus and need that one thumb typing ability like people get if they have a smaller phone. Now in addition to that, if we go back to Blink here, what we can do is we can actually split the keyboard for easier typing on the plus models because as you can see, now all the keys are split up into your two thumbs as opposed to having all the keys together. Now this will take a little getting used to because it's not your standard keyboard setup, however it can definitely be a great time saver once you learn how to do it in the long run. Overall, this is a great free keyboard app that I definitely recommend giving a try. Now, you can find the links to all of these keyboard apps in the description below. And in this episode, we're showing all free apps, but some of them do contain in-app purchases with pro upgrades. All right, let's take a look at the next iOS 9 keyboard app. The next application that we have is called Custom Keyboard. Now, the reason this app gets its name is because you can actually create your own custom keyboard from directly within the app. It's not just a preset keyboard that you get. So if you take a look here, I've already created a keyboard, but you can also create a brand new keyboard by clicking on the plus button, choosing a cool theme that you want, and there are a lot of th free themes that are available, like this, and then you can choose some of the different styles, how rounded you want the various letters to be, whether you want a little bit of indent on them, you can even change their color as well. From there, you're able to access multiple different fonts. Now, some of them are premium, but they do offer a few free fonts and colors as well so you can really customize how you want your keyboard to look. And then if you prefer, you can also add a sound effect as well. I usually like to keep my keyboards without sound, but you can of course add that. And then you'll just click the check button once that's done. 
Alright, let's take a look at one of the custom keyboards I made in this app. Now this app is certainly about customization over different features, but that is still great too. We just showed you an app that had amazing features, and now we'll show you a keyboard that has a lot of customization. So as you can see, I totally customized this to how I wanted it. It's easy to type, and they also have different suggestions as well at the top. Now, in addition to that, you can also, if you go back here, access different regular emojis and then also special emojis as well, which are kind of unique stylized emojis that come right with the keyboard. But it's definitely a great keyboard for customization purposes. Have you ever seen Instagram posts or other social media posts with really cool custom fonts and wondered how they got those? Well, with better fonts, you can easily access a multitude of different fonts directly from your keyboard. Now, I did change the theme, but there are multiple different themes involved, but I chose the gold theme. Now, you can go over to the different fonts and actually select from a wide variety of cool fonts that you can use on your social posts. Now, of course, they also have additional premium fonts as well, but as you can see, not all of them are locked. There are still so, some good fonts that you get access to right off the bat. So let's take a look at one of these fonts. As you can see, these are letters with little uh, circles around them, so we can just type whatever we want. And as you can see, that's a pretty cool font that's really going to help us liven up our Instagram posts or social media posts. So this is just a cool app that's got a lot of great fonts that are available for you to use for free. And then the premium version has tons of fonts that you can use as well. This next keyboard that we have is the first keyboard that's not actually meant to be your main keyboard. It's a supplement to your regular keyboard. Now this is called Phraseboard and it has multiple easy and usable phrases that you can reply to either text messages with or fill in forms with. So as you can see down here in the friends category, we have multiple different phrases that you might say to a friend. Now these are just the custom built ones. You can go into the Phraseboard app and add your own phrases as well. So as you can see, I can quickly just type something. So watch this. So I can go back to my normal keyboard and if I'm typing right away doing something else, I can easily switch over to Phraseboard and say, hey, what's up? Just like that. Now I can also switch this around to take a look at family. So hurry or I am ready or can I borrow some money? Even things like that are easily accessible in here. And of course, you can add your own phrases as well. Now you can see work. And one of the best is the ability to have personal quick links as well, so quick phrases. So as you can see, your home address, your email, first name, last name. I haven't programmed these in yet, but once you program these in, you just press the button and then it will fill in that form. So that'll make filling out forms on your iPhone so much easier. And again, this isn't meant to be used as your main keyboard. You can use your regular keyboard and then just switch to it at any time by clicking the world icon. So that's Phraseboard, and it's definitely a great supplement to your regular keyboard or custom keyboard on iOS 9. The next keyboard we have allows you to vastly improve your typing speeds by quickly swiping to type as opposed to tapping and lifting up your finger. Now this app is called SwiftKey, and it is available for free, unlike other swiping-based applications out there. Now those other apps are great as well, don't get me wrong, but this app lets you try it out to see if it's something that you like, and there's also a pro version in this app as well with more themes. So as you can see, you can quickly swipe to create words. Now that's opposed to lift, lifting up and typing individually. So as you can see, we've got hey written right there, and we also have suggestions as well, and it does a pretty good job basing those suggestions off of your standard post, so right, what you regularly write. Now, this is a great way to quickly and efficiently type without even having to lift your finger off the keyboard. Now, I'm still a little slow at it because I'm still rusty, but it's a great way to learn how to type like this, and once you do, you can get a lot faster at typing. This episode is brought to you by the What to Share keyboard. Now, although this is a sponsored keyboard, it is still a great keyboard that we recommend giving a try. You can download it using the link below. 
So as you can see here, I do have the blue theme and this keyboard is completely free with a lot of great themes. Uh, of course, you can see the pattern here. I chose the blue theme to go with it. Now, the cool thing about what to share is it allows you to share lots of cool social media images, uh, GIFs, you can create your own GIFs in here as well, and you can share large emojis. So it does work like a normal keyboard would, but in addition to that, you can access large specialized emojis. Now these aren't the standard one you get access to uh, with any Apple device. These are specialized emojis right here. Now you do have to cut and paste based on Apple's uh, sandbox, but it's really quick. You just cut and paste it directly from there and then paste it right in. And it looks amazing when you paste it in the Messages app as well. There are a lot of great uh, different emojis that you can use. Now in addition to that, you can actually have different emojis saying different things. So if the emoji is excited, you can hit create, insert your own a text like hello, something like that. Once you hit done, it'll allow you to save this and then publish that. Now, in addition, you can also send different audio clips directly through this as well. In addition, they also have a really cool meme generator, so you can upload a photo. Uh, obviously, you'll choose something a little bit more funny than the iPhone 6 uh, image, but you can, of course, add your own text in here as well, type whatever you want, and then you can quickly add that to your message as well. That way, you don't have to go out to some random website to do it. So this is a great social keyboard where you can interact with a lot of different memes, uh, different GIFs, you can have a lot of different emojis and even have them say things. So it's definitely a great keyboard to give a try. It's what to share. It's available for free using the link below. Now the next app has one of the best monetization models I've seen yet, and it's great for the users. So what they do is all of the keyboards except for the standard one you get right off the bat, and by the way, these are amazing and wonderfully designed keyboards, are premium, but they don't cost money they cost a vir virtual amount of coins. Now you actually get 1,000 coins right when you download the app. And as you can see, each of these other keyboards cost 100 coins. So you can get any keyboard you want, you're not limited, you're just limited to the amount of keyboards you can get for free. And then after that, of course, you can purchase more coins if you want more keyboards. But this is a great and fair way to allow you to choose the keyboard that you really want and get that keyboard. As you can see, I chose this really cool blue keyboard, and let's take a look at it in action. So as you probably already could tell based on my selection choices so far, blue is one of my favorite colors. And as you can see, this keyboard has a great blue tone with a nice dark, Bla almost black, but a little bit of navy thrown in their background. And as you can see, it looks amazing. This is probably one of the best looking keyboards that I've found, and it was available as a premium keyboard, but for free since they give you a certain amount of keyboards that you can get for free using the coins. That's just a great feature, and when I found out about that, I absolutely loved it. So as you can see, it does work like a normal keyboard. You can type whatever you want. It also does have predictive text at the top as well. And and it really, the main function of this is just to have a cool looking keyboard and I think they definitely succeeded. The next keyboard app that we have is Fancy Key. And Fancy Key has a lot of amazing keyboards. As you can see right up here, they have a ton of variety. They even have a candy keyboard. Now in addition to all of the great official keyboards, including some licensed keyboards such as the official Tron keyboard, uh, now that is premium of course, but some of these other keyboards you can download for free and you can also create your own. So you can pick a background, you can add some different elements to it as well. So if we go through here, you can choose different font styles that you want. Some of them are premium, but some of them do come with it as well. And then you can also choose a button style to go along with it and even change some of the other custom tapping effects. So you can have it do a different flair like that. Now some of these aspects are premium, however, they have a lot of great customization that comes with it. So let's take a look at one of the keyboards that I was able to make with Fancy Key. As you can see, I was able to make a really cool keyboard down here with Fancy Key, 
and I can of course type as normal. They also have additional abilities as well. Now in addition to that, they also have different fonts that you can use. So I actually already had one font enabled, I had the wave font. So as you can see, you can add different cool fonts to really liven it up. Now, I, did, I do have this text a little bit harder to see, that's just my customization, of course. It'll be a little bit easier to read based on what you decide to do. But as you can see, you can change uh, your customization for what the different font has. There's a lot of great options. And then in addition to that, they have some cool emojis. These are just a lot of the standard emojis that you can get as well. But then, they also have different emoji styles, so you can do a complete emoji, uh, different category thing so as you can see like hello and they have a lot of different emoji pictures that you can add and they have a huge variety of these as well and you can of course change the settings and even change the various themes that you have right here and as you can see this is another great theme it's a galaxy style theme so definitely fancy key is a great customizable keyboard and one of the best customizable keyboards on the app store right now the next keyboard app that we have has a few custom built keyboards built right into the application completely free. Now this is called Brilliant Keyboard and it definitely has a lot of great themes. Now as you can see you can just go down to this area over here and select some of the great themes that they have. Like this amazing red theme that looks really cool and this amazing blue theme that looks amazing as well. So as you can see you can just type right there and yes I know I said amazing a few times uh, but I just want to get across how cool this keyboard looks. It's got a lot of great styles as well so they're all available within the app itself. Definitely check out Brilliant Keyboard. It's got a lot of great themes. The next keyboard that we have is called Stack and it allows you to write out what you want to say. As you can see, you just write it and it'll automatically transcribe it. Now, this is definitely something if you want like a little break from using a keyboard. It's also a great novelty to show people as well. Overall, it, I don't know exactly how much you're going to use it, but it's definitely fun to play around with for a little bit and it could be a great break from using the regular keyboard. We certainly saved one of the best keyboards for last. And this one is called Keyboard Themes. And there are a lot of them. As you can see, there are a wide variety of amazing, beautifully done themes that are available completely free. Look at the side here. All of these are available for free. They've got really cool frosty themes. They have early sunrise. Just look at these. They look amazing. And they definitely work very well as well. Peppermint, all of these themes as I'm scrolling through were all free. And then there are a couple ones that cost coins, but in addition to paying for coins, you can even get coins for free by completing some offers as well. So that's another great way to get it. As you can see, right now there's only two premium themes that are available. The rest are all completely free with all of these great themes. Now let's take a look at one of these themes in action. It was really hard just to pick one, but I definitely recommend getting keyboard themes for all of these great themes that are available completely free. So as you can see, the theme that we chose for this keyboard looks absolutely amazing and it works well as well. As you can see, I can just type right there. Now you might notice that that looks a little strange, the text, and that's because I have a custom font. If you hold down on the return key, you can choose multiple different custom fonts in a really amazing UI picker right here. So you can choose a really cool font to use as well. You can also go into the settings right from the keyboard to quickly change the theme. This is definitely a great theme that's available for iOS 9. Thank you for watching my video on the best iOS 9 keyboards. Hopefully I showed you some great keyboards that allows you to find some cool themes, useful features such as the ability to type with just one thumb, and then of course different fonts as well and cool emojis to use. Now be sure to let me know what your favorite keyboard app is in the comment section below. I look forward to reading those. And if you learned something today, don't forget to like and share the video. It really helps because it takes a lot of time to produce this content and we're providing it for free. So I really appreciate it if you like and share this video. 
Also, make sure you subscribe for more iOS 9 and iPhone 6s and iPhone 6s Plus content to come. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.